Franklin County snow emergency is over, but there is still plenty of work to be done when it comes to the holiday weekend storm. The city of Columbus is still working on cleaning up today. NBC 4's Karina Chung has the plan of attack for Central Ohio plow drivers. Crews will be focusing on this a lot of slush. The goal is to make sure the roads are clear of it in case it gets cold enough to refreeze. Now I spoke with some residents who say they're hoping to see crews on their street. A street full of slush. That's what some residents are still facing today. You know what? I was hoping by four days later, five days later, that it'd be looking a little bit better, but definitely not. So a little bit of a bummer. Jack Staples lives along Michigan Avenue in the Harrison West neighborhood. He says with all the slush, it's difficult to get by on his street. Well, it's a tight road how it is too, so barely three or four cars can fit. So when both cars are going both ways, it's it's sticky for sure. Columbus City crews are still hard at work when it comes to storm treatment. Charles Newman, who is with the Department of Public Service for the city, says crews will be focusing on slick spots. Um, but for the most part, we're confident that we've hit at least between 95 and 96 percent of all the streets um, in, in the city um, to see a plow at least once throughout the event. Today is the first day snow plows won't be on 12 hour shifts. Newman says they're keeping an eye on the temperature. They want to avoid any slick roads or icy intersections post storm. We do have our um, crews, um, you know, sitting um, on standby. If it does freeze, if we need to do another uh, pre-treatment to get those out, but we're expecting with higher temperatures by the end of the week, hitting the 50s and, you know, staying around that 30 mark, we should be in good shape on our roads. Staples says he's lucky he has four-wheel drive. If he would have to travel, he's hoping crews make it to his street for a touch-up. So I definitely would like for somebody to come through, put some salt on the roads and for safety concerns and stuff. Newman says the best way to alert the city to any slick spots is to call 311. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Karina Chung, NBC4.